What's up, YouTube? This is United Idiots. This is Idiots Topic. Woohoo! What is up with that face, man? You look stupid. Ponytail. Ponytail. I can hit it with people. You look like a fucking orc. You look like the orc I just made in Skyrim. You're a nerd. Okay, let's move on. Oh yeah? Level 56, bitch. You're just jealous. Oh yeah. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha Not funny at all. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Idiot's Topic. Uh, tonight we are going to be talking about conspiracy theories. They have not been proven. And, um... But people just pick these up, I guess. I don't know. Like, maybe they are true, maybe they're not. You don't know. Okay. So, my conspiracy theory, the first one is, uh... Uh, John Lennon from the Beatles. Um, he was he was assassinated. But um, there, the conspiracy basically is like that the government did it. That we, the government was behind the assassination because at the time he was assassinated, and at the time he was really big and famous. Uh, the Vietnam the Vietnam War was going on, and this was basically like the, the hippie area era, and. They're all about peace and stuff, and John Lennon was really about peace, and he was non, he was anti-war. And, um, so, he always made songs about non-war things, and he was really popular, and this really spread throughout America. And basically, the conspiracy theory is that the government wanted to continue this war, and they didn't want influence about non-war in the country, so they were behind the assassination of John Lennon. Well, one thing about that is, is like he always made comments about how the government was following him and the government was stalking him about what he was talking about. And his quote is, the government is cornering me. And this was like before he got assassinated. Pharmacies and medicine companies are actually making us sick with their medication so they can sell more of my meds to make more money. Is is what all it is, just... Uh, <laughs> so basically what you're saying is like the government is like basically like is making this medication and the medication is actually making the people sick. Yeah, it's like but then when they're sick they want more medication and they give them the medication and they keep getting sick and they keep getting more money. Exactly. Okay, okay, so I got another conspiracy theory, and, um, this is, uh, I don't know, it's necessary. <laughs> called the, uh, Vatican Secret Arches. This is located in the Vatican City, and they're all, like, Catholics. It is, there are a bunch of dark documents that are located in, in the building, and it's separated from the library because these are more important documents. They don't want it to be, view, be viewed by the public, so these... These Vatican archives are always like start, stored away in files and stuff in like locked rooms. And many people believe that in these archives that there's uh, proof of extraterrestrial life in them. And that there's uh, documents from Ab like Abraham Lincoln and stuff, which actually I think it's true. There's also documents about Jesus, weird stuff about Jesus. And there's documents about the church, and uh, there's also documents with World War II, UFOs, all this weird stuff, and it's hidden away from the public. What the hell are you doing? Are you doing what I did? You're doing what I did from Truth or Dare. It's already hilarious. Dude, Mason just looks so weird. So basically, people believe that uh, the United States government actually knew about 9 11 before it happened. That some people, some government officials knew that we were going to be attacked. 
but they didn't say anything because am I if am I, we were attacked by am I the uh, terrorists, then we would be able to they, it would give us a, re a reason to invade Afghanistan and Iraq. Thank you guys for joining us with the idiots topic episode. Um, we would please like if you would put any questions or topics you want us to discuss below in the comments and give this video a like, subscribe, all that stupid stuff, and um, we're glad that you guys are here today. <laughs> Alright, see you guys. Tune in next week, too.